Hunkers, Hunker Monkers, how are you doing? Welcome to my channel. Ferret's just running up and down the stairs. Let me just give him a second to wear his energy out. Otherwise you're gonna hear the little pitter patter of tiny footsteps throughout this whole video. He's like, let me in, let me in. I know you've got stuff I can chew in there. So uh, today I have a reaction video. There is a online, online TV show. It's not really TV, online show called Hooked on the Look, Transformed, part of, um, I, I don't know, True TV's a series. Um, which actually I took part, let's make it about me. I took part in the first series of it. I, shh, ferret, shh. I took part in the first series of it. Um, I will link it at the end of this video if you want to check that out. It's basically they take people that have one strong style and they give them a completely different style. There's lots of very heavily alternative people and they make them look basic bitches. Um, but they have done it the other way. They, they have taken basic bitches. They have taken people that dress, you know, they have taken beige mums and God forbid put them in a little bit of pastel. But it is a, it is a, it's a, it's a bit of fun, isn't it? It's a bit of fancy dress, dress up, little bit of, well, they made me look like Carol Baskin. But it's a little bit of fun and and today we are reacting to my friend Angel who has just done an episode. <gasps> actually a few of my friends have done episodes now and I love it so much. Actually I found out recently that one of my friends was on an episode of Snog Marry Avoid and I had no idea. It showed you how close we are. Um, so maybe I'll react to that at some point. Right, let's do this. I have my laptop with my stickers on. Oh, this is peeling off. It's peeling off. <gasps> Ghost. Do you know why this is peeling off? Because my rats chew the stickers. They climb on my laptop and they're like. <laughs> I don't blame them. I'd eat Ghostface too. <laughs> Delicious. So I've got my laptop. Let's go. Hooked on the look. I can't spell because I left school early. Ooh. I'm getting my illegal butt shots removed. Oh, that's one booty. Um, oh, there's loads, there's loads. I haven't watched it in so long. I, I do follow Hooked on the Look online, but I've muted them so that I can't, oh, there's loads, so that I can't see them. Oh, I can't see it, I can't see it. Just in case I do a reaction video. Where are, bitch, where are you? Let's click on it. Truly, truly, madly, deeply love you. I can't find you. This could be the shortest video ever. Hold on, she messaged me the link. <laughs> I'm loving angels instead, and through it. Does, does anyone else get really creepy? Oh, there's a different channel, Transformed. Does anyone else get really creepy, creepy vibes from Robbie Williams? Right, Transformed, vampire, vampire, to street. Wear. Oh, there's my baby. I can't imagine her in streetwear. So Angel does drag. She has freaking amazing makeup. She's got titties for days. Very black and red aesthetic and one of the genuinely loveliest people I've ever met in my life. What a wonderful babe. My fiance loves it. Dad, what are you doing? We need to keep her on the dark side. Okay, are we ready? I need a headphone. I need a headphone, otherwise editing this becomes a nightmare. Do I have any within reach? Of course I don't, of course I don't. I have to fight through freaking Jumanji ferrets to go and get a headphone. Ugh! Ugh. Considering I live with a man who would shag a television if he could. It took me a long time to find these headphones. <laughs> My headphones are wireless and I have to, I don't know how to connect them to the laptop so I need wired ones. Look, I don't know how to get into the 2024th century. Now look, Ferret chased me up the stairs and I had to give him some ham to stop him chasing me. And then my sister had a baby and the baby brought was born with no legs. <laughs> and everything just went wrong. And now Angel's staring at me. <laughs> On another note, I'm going out later. Going to a queer music event. How fantabulous, I'm quite excited. Going to listen to some screamy music with my friends. <sighs> God, you wait, these headphones won't work. And then I'll ask Ben, like, why have you got headphones that don't work? And he'll be like, wires, I might need them one day. 
oh, why are men like this? He has a drawer, I say a drawer, he literally has a massive tub of wires that don't wire to anything. Like, why are men like this? Why are, <gasps> are men like this? I swear, if I get like an earwax infection from these, I'm gonna sue Ben. There's no point, I already take all the money he has. Oh God, moment of truth. Am I about to get electrocuted? To my channel. I mean, that's plugged in. Oh, come on! That's my sound check, um, which you can obviously hear. <laughs> Why have you got headphones that don't work, Ben? We're just gonna have to raw dog this. It just means I have to pause it every time that I talk, which doesn't sound like a big deal, but I, um, I interrupt everybody, I interrupt myself, and I, it's just gonna be a, it's, it just means night, it just means editing's gonna be so much more difficult. But that's a me problem! So let's start, let's start. Vampire the streetwear, let's see my gorgeous girly, my black and red princess. Let's do this. Shuffle over this way. Shuffle, shuffle. Oh, bring my table, bring me top lap. Ooh, turn the sound on. Sleeves up, because we're gonna be fisting. Go. 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 Just freaking go. Today I'm being transformed from my gothic vampire look into a classic street style. If I could summarize my look in a few words, they would be sexy, glamorous, Gothy, vampy, elegance. That's exactly what she is! Sexy, vampy, glamorous, whatever else she said. And those wings, those wings she's got on, she had them on at Alternative Model of the Year and they, they go, oh, those wings wing. They wing, I don't know how else to explain it. Like when you sneak up to a pigeon, you're like, oh, I've got some bread. <laughs> and then he realizes you haven't got any bread. And then they turn around and look at you and go, oh, oh with really disappointed eyes, and then they fly. Fly, fly. That's what those wings do. Are you ready to see yourself? I'm incredibly excited. Not the red bomber jacket! Oh, right, we've only just started, come on. <sighs> She's gonna look beautiful no matter what. She's a gorgeous girl, but I already don't want, I already don't like it. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Okay. One, two, oh my God. Can't wait to see her. Bit nervous, actually. <laughs> little Dan! Little Dan was my little friend. Um, so I first met, sorry, I'm making it about me again. I first met Angel at Alternative Model of the Year and, and Dan was my little friend for the catwalk and we like, we, we, we was like talking about everybody as they came down the catwalk like, oh, Dan in that lovely dress, in that lovely dress, Dan. And, and, and I was, yeah, so hi, Dan. <laughs> Bring her on. <laughs> <laughs> Dan, that laugh was a bit rude. Wow. <laughs> Hello, Hi. how are you? I'm good, how are you? Yeah, I'm good, thank you. Good. I'm Amy. I'm Angel, come on in. Nice to meet you. My name is Angel and I would describe my look as a vampire goth with mystical fey elements. What attracts me to the gothic vampire aesthetic are the colours, the bright reds especially. I'm a you see that picture? You see that picture? With the, uh, see that picture? With, with the bushes in the background? Bitch, I took that picture. Does she live in like little Snow White's cottage? The little brick, I mean, I live in, I live in a rubbish town. All our houses are like terraced cardboard cutouts. This looks like a little Snow White cottage. It's really adorable. And how freaking gorgeous does she look with red hair? She's, some people just really suit one color and she, red is her color. My friend on the show, <laughs> but also the elegance, but just also how badass it looks. The key element of my look is chains, big eyelashes, fangs, and pointed ears. There's an ad. We are well. There's one. We can't see how long we're in the video, but there's a freaking ad. I'm gonna talk to you while the ad's playing. Oh, shit, that's what a babe, what a babe. She reminds me of the babe, what babe? The babe with the power, what power? The power of voodoo, who do you do, do what? Remind me of the babe. Gymshark, I don't go to the gym. Why, oh, snotty septum, stop. I'm waiting for my septum to, like I've got a, a, a sore septum at the moment because it's just started playing up all of a sudden. I'm waiting to stretch it again and it knows, it knows. I'm waiting for it to stop 
being sore so I can stretch it again. Oh, we can skip the ad now. That was one minute, one minute, four seconds into the video and we got an ad. I mean, I will cut that out for my video, but one minute, four seconds into a video and you put an ad. If this wasn't my friend, I would never watch your channel again. Damn. We're gonna do a bit more of a soft glam, like Kim Kardashian inspired sort of look, streetwear. Sorry, you all know how I feel about Miss KKK. Um, that was an extra K, but. <laughs> Um, get your ass up and work. Nobody wants to work anymore. Bitch, we are working. We don't have money, money. We don't have money, a million nannies. We don't have what you have. Sorry, we're gonna get into a run. People like Kim, and before you say I'm jealous of Kim Kardashian, of course I am. She's got millions, millions. She's got millions but she lives in like a sand castle add some spice to your house love i can't stand when people have everything they could ever want everything at their beck and call she could click her fingers and be like i'm gonna start a business tomorrow and it's gonna do well because of who i am and then she tells other people who have nothing, who cannot pay their bills. I went to buy cornflakes yesterday at Tesco. £4.20 for a box of Kellogg's cornflakes. I put those motherfuckers back. £4.20 for a box of cornflakes. I mean, I got cinnamon grams instead. They're better. Then they were smaller, but they were £2 something. So I, I, ultimately I won, but I really fancy cornflakes. It annoys me when people that literally have everything are like, people don't want to get, they don't want to do anything. They don't want to work. It's like, bitch, we are trying. We're trying to survive while you're living in a beige world. Everybody in Hollywood looks the same now. Have you noticed this? Please don't make my friend look like a Kardashian. She's worth so much more than that. And um, we're gonna have piercing eyes, a nice big lip, so we're going a bit overlined. I want piercing eyes. Has anyone seen that TikToker that has glass eyes and they've got one that has a piercing through it? I don't think that's what she means by piercing eyes. God, Angel's room is so cute. Just making it look really snatched. Do you think you're gonna feel really bad? Remove vampire goth makeup, all the black on Angel's neck is makeup, but I was just looking at it like, bitch, that's my neck after two days of not washing it. I'm just freaking dirty. <laughs> I think I'm gonna feel a bit naked, yeah. Yeah. It's gonna be strange. I've been dressing this way for probably over 10 years. It's just a style that I've always gravitated towards. I think I just, I never really liked feeling the same as everyone else. So I started to experiment with makeup and clothing and it just gradually developed into this. Can we just take a second to appreciate how freaking stunning she is? Step two, tattoo cover up. Can we just skip this step? No one should have to cover, I know. I <laughs> Don't cover up your tattoos. Although covering up your tattoos makes the biggest difference to who you are. You instantly feel like a different person because they become a part, like you wake up in the morning, you don't notice your tattoos because they can't become a part of you. I don't look down at my skin, I'm like, oh, tattoos. I look down, I'm like, oh, I didn't chop my arm off in my sleep. So when you cover them up and you see blank skin, it becomes something you're like, oh, wow. I haven't seen my arm a natural colour in a few years. I mean, ah, so I'm excited, I'm excited. Look, we're only one minute, 46 seconds into the video. This is gonna be such a long video. This is NYX. It's just a concealer. It just cancels out the colours in the tattoo. Why have you decided to do this transformation? Because I wanted to experience what my look might have been if I had continued with the looks that I had before I started to be a goth and see what I might have turned out like. You've not really seen your adult no, self I in. I used to dress in a lot of pink. Uh, Mum used to put me in pink tracksuits and my whole room was pink. I don't know what happened, but I just loved pink back then and I used to have long blonde hair as well. What happened? Why you, why you, you could be Taylor Swift's stunt double. What happened? That's not you. That's not you. Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? That looks nothing like you. That looks nothing like you. I'm, I'm, oh my God. That looks 
nothing like you. I'm a shocker. That looks nothing like you. I feel like this is a darkly kept secret that you should have never let out of the box. You should. No, I, Angel, came out of the womb black and red with fake eyelashes. Oh my god, this, this, that's actually blowing my mind. Because I'm naturally blonde. How much, I say, one of my favourite films in the entire world is called 13. Evan Rachel Wood, I love Evan Rachel Wood. That film is my life, was my life when I was that age. She looks so much like Evan Rachel Wood in that film. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's uncanny. Are you secretly Evan Rachel Wood? And it was a look. Not my vibe now though. This is a NYX. Um, brow pencil and apply eyebrow makeup like can we skip this because um <laughs> eyebrows trigger me because i i've shaved my eyebrows off since i was like 13 i've grown them back a couple of times throughout the years and i always end up shaving them off and then i I get bored drawing them back on and I give up and then they just end up looking like this. But I'm so used to them looking like shit that I don't care. So I feel like this is gonna trigger me because they're gonna look amazing. <laughs> and then I'm gonna be like, I, I wanna refill my video and uh, do my eyebrows better. <laughs> Espresso just draws really nice fine hairs on. Because Angel's got no brow at all. We need to. My no brow sister. Draw some little fine hairs on. Do you get judged on the way you look or dress? I used to get judged for dressing like this, more so when I was at school. Whose ass do I need to kick? Tell me, Angel. I don't care if they're 12 years old. I am four foot 11. I will be the same height as them. I can put a parker on. I can put a backpack on. I can sneak into their school and I can kick their ass. Honestly, I do the school run, obviously with my daughter, and when I have my hood up, I look like one of the kids. <laughs> Angel, I will come and protect you. I can do a pretty nasty shin kick. Honestly, I just, I don't care about them anymore. You know, if you've got time to judge someone in your life, then you don't have a very good life. That's your problem, it's not my problem. I'm gonna move on and be happy. No wiser words were ever spoken. Einstein who? Thomas Edison who? Any other philosophers who? Angel. Angel is the list of philosophizers. She's speaking facts. Who are you revealing your look to today? I am revealing my look to my mum and my fiance. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna be really shocked. Hi. If you kind of look more how I remembered you from being little, I don't know, who knows? I might get a bit emotional about it. I'm excited for you as well. and. Uh, I'm interested to see whether you'll really like it and decide to maybe keep, keep it on a bit or if you'll Sorry. just be like, no, straight, straight back. <laughs> Helen, Helen, stop. Don't give her ideas. We need to keep her on the dark side. And how good does Helen look? I love the taped up remote control next to Helen. And we've all, we've all got one. We've all got one. <laughs> My remote control has all the buttons chewed off because of my rat and the back is in fact taped on. So I feel like this is British rite of passage. <laughs> but no, we're gonna keep her on the dark side. <laughs> no, Angel's not gonna change, so yeah. Take a good look, cause this might be the last time that you'll see me in something like this, but I doubt it. Putting some eyelashes on. They might be a little bit different to what Angel's used to. Yep, way smaller. I'm so jealous of people that can wear false eyelashes. I can wear little ones. I did um I did buy some little ones. I do I can wear little ones, but they hit my glasses, so I can't wear like super long ones. The ones that they, they've just put on Angel look probably the maximum I could go to. Cause considering she wears such long like palm tree leaf lashes. They look like natural lashes on her. Right, Angel. What's your makeup all done, girl? Fantastic. Let's get dressed. Awesome. Are you ready to see yourself? I'm incredibly excited. Girl, okay, let's do it. Okay. Let's go! Alright, I gotta pause it. I'm so scared because 
<laughs> this is not how I know my friend. So I haven't said it yet, but this is not how I know my friend. Um, I know her as the black and red, spooky, beautiful vampire individual and she's perfect the way she is. Um, if she decides to stay as this streetwear being, <laughs> I love her no matter what. I'm, 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 I'm scared. It's so weird because I've done these reactions before but it's never someone that I know. But this is someone that I know and, and I've tried so hard to avoid looking at the transformation. So I'm, okay, okay, shut up Emily. Let's... It's another ad! That really hurt my throat. It's another ad! Two ads in an eight minute video? Damn, are you that hard up for money? I want you to know if you put ads in your video and it's shorter than 30 minutes, I will purposely never buy your product. Never, ever, ever. Um, so this ad is for better help. I will... Therapy is amazing. Go to therapy if you need it. But I will purposely never go to BetterHelp simply because there is an ad in the middle of the video that I was really enjoying. And actually the video I was watching was giving me a serotonin boost and you have interrupted my serotonin boost to tell me to go to therapy. But I was doing my own therapy. I was getting my own therapy. Shut up you paid actor. I don't care what you've got to say. <laughs> Who is she? <laughs> Who is she? Who is she? Where did you find her? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, I don't like it. I don't like it. Shit, I'm sorry, Angel. <laughs> I'm so sorry. What have you done to my friend? Aside from age her about 15 years. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna feel so freaking terrible if she says she likes it. Shit, I don't want to be an asshole. She looks amazing. She looks amazing. <laughs> I'm so used to seeing her in the black and red and everything. And, and this, oh my God, I was not expecting that jump scare. Baby girl, that's not you. That's not you. Oh my God. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the side by side before and after actually it looks a lot better. She actually looks really, really freaking cute. And she looks a lot better in this shot than she did. Like, I, th I think because there was an ad, it just jump scared me. She actually looks really beautiful. She looks like a little China doll. But oh my, but the, the mystical fantasy Dungeons and Dragons-y black and red side is just so, is her. God, I can't, can we... I thought bomber jackets left the world in the 90s. I do love 90s fans. She looks like she's going to the office. Why do they never style the wigs on these shows? Like no hate to the makeup artist, but it's always a sh it's all it's just always a shake and go. Like just like, pump it up a little bit. Pump it, ladder, don't stop. Pump it up a little bit, curl it. Don't just take it out of the bag and like, oh, you're good to go. If that had had like a bit of volume, maybe a fringe, I think that would have looked a bit nicer on her the color though the with the hair color does look so gorgeous on her and really does suit her i can't get over that top that's screaming i work nine to five what a way to make a living and the necklace is very page 72 of the argos catalog uh, do you know i look like i kind of look like Gemma collins a bit <laughs> Like an Essex babe. <laughs> like an Essex babe. Oh my god, she does. I would not have put her in that outfit. I would have gone for something completely different. I feel like they did her dirty with that outfit. Especially the bottom half. It, it doesn't go with the rest of it. But, but then, to be fair, I don't really know fashion. The makeup is so pretty on her though. She does look so gorgeous. I think her fiance Dan is gonna love this. And as a mum, I think her mum's gonna love it just because it's her baby and I feel like her mum's gonna love it. But I think she's gonna go right back to being her black and red self. <laughs> Let's find out. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, do you know, I like this. The makeup's done beautifully. Absolutely stunning. Baby, burn that jacket. Burn it. 
burn it. If you zip that up, someone's gonna try and put you in a spaghetti bolognese. And it's weird not seeing my tattoo there either. But I do kind of love it. <laughs> the hair colour is taking me back to being that child that used to wear jackets like this and just live her best life. Oh, everyone's gonna be so surprised. No one has seen me like this in so long that it's gonna be such a huge shock. How are you feeling? Excited. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> really excited. Yeah. Can't wait to see her. A bit nervous, actually. Yeah, <laughs> yeah a little bit. Bring, bring her on. Dan's like, oh, it's like having a new girlfriend. <laughs> Okay, you ready for the family reveal? Let's do this, let's do this. And tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be an Essex girl. <laughs> oh <my God>. Wow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You look great. I look oh, I different. Love it. You certainly do, yeah. <laughs> you look like all the girls I grew up with at school. <laughs> I think it really suits you. Really? Yeah, I do, yeah. So you got a tan on as well. <laughs> oh, her mum's making me want to cry. Because her mum, like, I feel like it's a mum thing. Like, my daughter is my daughter. If she grows up and gets covered in tattoos, I don't care. Her body, she can do what she wants. But I want her to stay as my little baby girl forever because she's my little baby girl. I think about this a lot actually. I think about this because when I go to sleep I think about things. I think because my daughter is very much a tomboy. Um, she dresses like Ken from the Barbie movie, like tracksuits, and I freaking love it. And I think about when she grows up, if she chooses to get married, and she cho and if she chooses to wear a wedding dress, if she sticks with this tracksuit life, I mean, comfort, baby, go for it. I am going to ball my eyes out because I would have never seen her in a dress, in a white dress. Does that make sense? That's kind of what I'm meaning. It's still my daughter, but it's just a different version of my daughter. I, I don't know. If, I don't know if I'm articulating that right. Like that's still her daughter, but it's a different version. I know what I mean. So Helen. I would have bored my eyes out because it's just, it's your child and you love your child and, and that's, that's, that's okay. Dan's just like, I am uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Dan, you're so sweet. I love saving, don't have the tattoo there. Oh my God, yeah. Painted them off, eh? You look so normal. <laughs> <laughs> I like everything. It's the hair, the jacket especially. I really like the jacket. Dan, do me a favour and burn that jacket. The thing is, it's, <laughs> Angel will probably wear this jacket in her normal wardrobe and style it with all her black and red and it will look perfect. It will go so well with her actual wardrobe. And then I'll be, then I will eat my words. I'll be like, Bolognese who? Because it will look so good with her actual wardrobe. But just with this outfit, this hair, I just can't say it. I can't see it. But she does look freaking amazing. Skirt, top, everything. It's just great. Yes. Yes to all. <laughs> I love the blonde. Obviously she's a natural blonde, so it's lovely to see her. Cause what were, you, what were we saying before? You were about 12, 13 and you've never yeah. been back. So I know it's lovely to see you with that blonde hair. I just think the makeup looks lovely. It looks really natural. No, it is. It's, it is bringing back a few memories of the old angel. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> you look lovely. Don't cry, Helen. Don't cry. You'll start me off. But that is really sweet. She does look so gorgeous. I feel like she could pull off any look. Just stay away from black and green, bitch. Oh, well, I'm black and purple at the minute, but I'm going back to green soon. Yeah. Don't get any makeup on you. <laughs> Their reactions were bigger than I ever thought they were going to be. I didn't expect them to be as shocked as they were but I'm really glad that they were happily surprised by it. This experience has taught me that I am unique, that I am happier in my unique style than I am in this sort of style, but also that it's okay to try new colours and things that are completely out of my comfort zone. If you don't try, you'll never know. 
I've been saying that to my partner for years. If you don't try these things, men, you never know if you like them. I'm <laughs> true though, like on a serious note, if you don't try different styles or you don't try different makeup looks or different hair, you'll never know if you like it. So she may not like the whole style altogether, but she could take key pieces away from it, like the jacket, and put that in her actual wardrobe. If she'd have seen it on a coat hanger in, in a shop, it might not have been something that jumped out at her, but it might be something that she could style up and put man, I really like that I really like that and I think that's a lovely thing to take from this experience and you know life's about having fun and I'm so glad she had fun and she looks freaking beautiful oh there's other ones grunge glam to girl next door my girl next door makeover I feel exposed oh if there's any other ones you want me to react to um send them to me on Instagram but I think yeah that's it she looks freaking amazing and I'm so glad she got to take part in it because when I did mine it was so much fun it, it, it you know it only took a day and you got to keep the clothes like I got to keep the clothes I hope you got to keep the clothes too Angel it was it was it was a lot of fun oh, I'm gonna shuffle back in the middle because oh. oh move my camera she tried out a different style. She might keep some of it. She might keep all of it. She might have woken up the next day and was like, actually, I really enjoyed that look. Um, fuck what Emily thinks. I'm going to embrace the Gemma Collins and do this life. I'm gonna go full Essex glam. And she, do you know what? She looks amazing, so go for it. Yeah, I'm so, so, so proud of her. She just looks so freaking gorgeous. Oh, rainbow, rainbow girl to Kim Kardashian. Oh, that looks like a good one. Some of these have got shit loads of views. I need to like go down the ones that have the most views, don't I? Because maybe they're the most interesting. What's an Insta baddie? I look like Khloe Kardashian. Khloe Kardashian doesn't even look like Khloe Kardashian. Okay, look, stop. Oh, there's someone else I know! That's P! Okay, maybe we can react to P's next. Um, okay, let's close the laptop because I don't want to look at it anymore. I don't want to spoil the surprise. I hope you enjoyed this. It feels really weird judging my friends, so I hope you enjoyed this because I'm probably going to get a message like, Oh, you are harsh. You are harsh. Meow. <laughs> but this was a lot of fun, you know, being a bitch. I hope you enjoyed this video and Angel looks amazing. High five to Helen. I see you in your taped up remote control. And Dan, I don't know. Hi Dan. <laughs> um, yeah, this was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed watching the episode with me. Um, let's do some more, let's do some more. I will pop Angel's Instagram and everything in the description below. Please check her out because she's one of the most kind, genuine, loveliest people you will ever meet and She's so, she's so lovely and she's just started doing drag let's lift each other up but that is it guys it's just so weird to watch my friends get maked over like I, I, it's just and now I've got another person that I know who got maked over so and and someone else who was on somewhere avoid I don't I, I, oh, there's so many I just hate editing these videos so that's why I don't do them often but there's so many people that I know so maybe I'll actually just have to sit and do them and yeah let me know if you enjoyed this and I will do more of them but yeah thank you so much for watching I'll pop angels everything in the description below if you can please do check out my patreon because it really does help out my channel and if you just want to buy me a hot chocolate because I am freaking obsessed obsessed with Nero hot chocolates at the moment especially because my local Nero has chocolate squirty cream and it is the best thing in the world you can tip me on ko-fi in the link below and that buys me a Nero hot chocolate give this video a big thumbs up and if you haven't already hit that subscribe button and I will see you very soon with another video much love boobs take care of yourself and most of all dress in a way that makes you happy do what makes you happy and stay weird.